Alrighty, so Thorgar, how do you feel about crossing a river? I bet you'd like it. Let's do it. Flowing from the Middle Mountains, the Rubek is a fast-flowing tributary of the Talabek. On the southern bank, the Empire has drawn up its first defense lines on the route to Talabayam. Fight! So all of our heroes, obviously. Did I remember to mount the Aspiring Champion? Yes, I did. Good. <laughs> I wasn't sure if I had to do it again at the beginning of the next chapter. So we'll bring these three units. And why not? The Furies did good work. And we'll bring a third unit of Warriors. And the Cannon, obviously. Good idea, me. Now, we picked up some stuff in the last mission. I believe there was a crown. And the Cloak of Kings. I kind of want to put that on him. Plus two armor. Yeah, he's going to wear this. Happy birthday. The Long Runner Boots versus the Jugger Boots. Nah. The Rod of Domination. Plus 15% to all spells. Is that better than this? What? Does he lose if he wears it? Okay, he's down to 31 hit points, but... Plus 15% to all spells. Pretty good. So we'll go with that. Thorgar the Blooded One. You picked up some cool stuff. The Crown of Everlasting Conquest. Uh, yes. You get to wear that. It's better than your current uh, helmet. The Gotten Helm is nice, but it's not fantastic. Um, the Gotten Helm can go to the Champion of Corn then. Scorpion Sword, not really a big deal. Silver Thread, Steel Thread Cloak? Nah, not a big deal. The Crimson Armor of Dargan. Airy damage to melee attack models causes fear. I think he causes fear already, though. I'm pretty sure he causes fear already as, like, a, a passive thing. So I might throw that over to this guy as well. The Armor of Tortured Souls. I don't know. Plus 20% melee resistance. Yeah, you know, we'll try it on Thorgar. Apparently you can set this thing on fire. I wonder if you actually can. Well, that'll be an interesting experiment. Can you set yourself on fire? Probably. Alright, let's go. It wouldn't surprise me. I mean, this game... This game seems kind of outlandish in some respects, but it's really not. Like, that's a thing that would happen in the Warhammer tabletop game as well. You'd be like, I set myself on fire. Your opponent would go, with what item? As opposed to, you what now? It's a beautiful thing. So we'll cross the Rubek. If this is any indication of what we'll be facing, knights could be a problem. I think we'll be okay, though. The worst thing knights could really do realistically is attack and hurt Thorgar somewhat. A river assault can cost many lives as troops are bombarded by the enemy on the slow crossing or forced to gather close together to make use of bridges and forts. Well I imagine they probably have some artillery but so do we and I'm hoping that our furies will be able to scout ahead and show us what we need to see. Alright so Thorgar his, his transformation to demonhood means that he has a slight problem in that he can't join units anymore. He's He has to be all by himself. He is Celine Dio. Um, you can join the them. Let us slaughter these and you, of course, will join the knights. Burn them all! So this will be group number one. Your knights You'll be group stand number two. Ready. You'll be group number three. And Thorgar won't get a group, neither Prepare will the goats. We are moving on! Our advances and the shall hear the death cries of my foes this day. Yes, yes, they shall. My Lord wishes. Alright, that lies across that river. Destroy anyone that opposes me. Yeah, yeah, we will. We Calm shall down. Destroy them all. And cannon. Be praised. To hear None you guys. Mighty corn. Well, you guy, really. It's only Let one fellow. Thorgar is come. just one man. Well, one D-man. Alright, what do we got over there? Some hand gunners. And is that an eagle? That is a great eagle. Praise that the could gods. be a problem. Oh, what do I see over yours. there? Halberdiers, huh? We may have to deal with them in a minute. We shall be as kings! Alright, let's try stealing soul. That kind of worked. 
wonder if this will help. Not really. Alright. Furies, get on it. Show no mercy. The eagle is powerful, but our furies outnumber it. So like the dragon, it should go down to the sustained attack. It's going to keep swooping though, which is a slight issue. So right now it appears to be swooping Thorgar, which is probably the best unit that we could hope for it to swoop, because the more it swoops Thorgar, the less effective it actually is, because he's got regeneration. Would you leave my guys alone? That's not very nice. Stop it. Right, let's move the cannon forward. Move our guys forward too. Is that a cannon? That is a cannon. Right, we need to fire at it. Halt. Alright, this could be a problem. Pull back. Ow. That wasn't very nice. Alright, a cannon should have the upper hand on it though because it's actually shooting back. I will send these guys though. The Furies can do some good work. I'm going to move the knights over here. Thorgar can go up there. Now, the good thing is that they're also hitting the unit with the sorcerer in it. So not something I really have to worry about. Now, please, Cannon. Do me proud. Alright, Furies retreat. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the... Stop it. Furious, get back over here. Alright, that cannon should be done as soon as this guy fires again. As you wish, favored one. Hello, Halberdiers. Would you stop it? I do not appreciate it when you throw things at me like that. That's not cool. That is not even slightly cool. Burn them all. On the plus side, you did give me some food. Nom. Okay, now they're shooting at me and they can't even see me. That's called cheating. Wait, no, stop it. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Alright, I've got a plan. I'm gonna put Thorgar over here. Because, as I said, Thorgar has regeneration. Being shot at, not that big of a deal for him. Eat their souls. Alright, come over here, deal with this. Now hopefully they'll start shooting at Thorgar, because Thorgar can take those hits. We're gonna fire at the repeating bolts. But as I said, it doesn't make... Oi! Stop it! It doesn't make that much of a big difference who they shoot at. Because we've got a ton of cash. So we can replenish most of these guys. I'm hoping though that they will start shooting Thor. And yeah, you can set yourself on fire. I approve of this. Now did we hit? I'm not sure if we hit or missed. It's not that big of a deal though. Can you eat their souls? Alright, good. Now they're shooting Thor. And that is a Jade Wizard. I'm not pleased by this. Jade Wizard, bad news. We know this. We played with one in the Empire campaign. These guys, they're not nice. Come here. We need to continue eating these guys. Nope. Good job. Alright, Thogar. Might be almost time for him to retreat, but... We've damaged the bolt thrower. It is the will of the Dark Lord. So it's not the end of the world. We'll throw that down. So they die. None can oppose mighty God. Yeah, it's time for him to fall back. Waste Our knights can get in there. We, we, we steal kings. your souls. Thank you. Fight for the gods! Charge! Alright, fire. We should be able to, with one last shot, finish that off. 
As long as we don't miss. Please don't miss. I'd really appreciate you shooting, actually. I don't know if we missed or not. We might have. Alright, we'll eat their souls. Nom nom nom. Delicious. Cannon. Any any time. Standing ready to fire, Commander. the beast. Oh, okay. I guess we got it. <laughs> it just didn't look like we did. I didn't see a projectile go flying. You come here. Delicious souls. Alright, now we got this. Now we're all good. Well, I guess we weren't going to lose, but the most troublesome things are out of the way. Apart from that Jade Wizard. But the Jade Wizard, he's not a big deal. He's not a major concern. We can deal with him. He's fairly simple to get rid of. We'll just go up and slap him a few times, then he'll die. Victory will be ours. Good things will happen. Sorcerer, go deal with these guys. Furies. I didn't mean for you to go sit out there. As you command, That's just one. silly. There we go. And now there are nine. Those are hand gunners, though. I'm concerned about the hand gunners. Sir Nagron's finest labor. Burn them all. No. We shall cross them. Right, go kill them. Merely so no and we should be able to use the Furies fairly effectively. The God shall Send you across two. Oh hey, we broke that unit with one shot. Nice. No mercy. Arrows Throw that down there. You stop it with your magical shenanigan. Wow, did he just kill all of them? I think he did. Deliciously beautiful. Alright, Furies. Go and put an end to this man. Across there. Cannon. Need up here. Knights. Go find out what's over this way. Life shall be your death. See, you say that, but you're done. See? There can be no victory. Death sword is ring. Masters. As you command, chosen one. Pain is I actually don't know what that death sword ring is. Crush them. Oh, yes, I do. It's the unbreakable ring. Oh, mighty God. As the God says with your gifts, that we might prevail. Be victorious. Pick that up. Standard of implacable courage, huh? That could be good. I think there was two banners there. Furious retreat. You will die if you don't. Alright, go around the corner. Golga, you can come help out too. This world will be ours. That's a prince, huh? There shall be no mercy. He could be a problem. He, was, wish, he is pretty one. powerful. I shall go where the gods send me. This light cavalry I do not like, so I will kill. Illyrian Reavers. You are providing me with no end of problems. Charge. You go kill him. You go kill them too. Wait, what? Oh, damn it. They must be destroyed. Well, whatever. Oh, my God. Kill them all. We will pay the road to the city with their bones. There can be no victory. The aspiring champion should be fine. And we'll come help out. There we go. Charge. You sit up here. 31. You should be okay. If need be, we'll retreat him. Oh yeah, you know what I haven't done this entire time? The Ring of Change. 
Probably should have used that at some point. So. Spawn. Thorgar, come over here. I want you to deal with this guy. The cannon can start shooting. Oh hey, no it can't. That's that's dudes. Hey. Challenge accepted. And knights, where are you? Come over here. Oh, that that's a side effect that I didn't consider. They might kill him. <laughs> well, I'll send the Furies to help out. We shall destroy the land for the mighty gods of the north. There we go. Furies, get them. Oh, you guys, get them. The rest of you, destroy these things. Resistance. We need to destroy all the tents. Which is why I'm bothering to do it. If we didn't have to, I wouldn't bother. But we do. Such is our life. Decapitate that some bitch. Never faced. It is the will of the Dark Lord that brings us victory. Die, Shadow Warriors, die. Alright, chop his head off. Yes! Like the rising tide, their blood will Berserker flow. sword? I actually don't know what that is. A thousand so that could be something for cool. Toil. Blood for the blood god. Show no mercy. You guys deal with this. Ground. Your knights stand attack. ready. And attack. The gods favor the us with this bountiful carnage. I'm pretty sure that's the objective, isn't it? Yeah, destroy the Empire and High Elf Camp, Thorgar must survive. The gods favor us with this bountiful carnage. Burn yep. it to the ground! And destroy that, and that will be that's done. Yes. Yes. Victory! And then we can have a look and see what that Berserker Sword is, because I don't actually know. Berserker Sword could be quite good. The tide of chaos stretches each Hooray, tide of chaos. <laughs> it's like the sea, but more violent. So that is the second to last fight in this entire campaign. If you count the duel. So we found 10,000 gold. If you're worried about money, you don't have to be. And what's this thing that we found? Berserker sword. Plus 15% chance to hit, plus 20% attack speed, the Berserker Sword fills all who carry it with an unquenchable battle fury. Ooh. See, the Sword of Might's really good. But so's the Berserker Sword. I wonder if I've got anything that increases his max health that I could put on him, like a, a ring. No. Not really helpful. Not really helpful. Oh hey, it's another Banner of the Gods. Well, um, in that case, I will give it to you guys. So that should be... I thought we had another unit with the Banner of the Gods. I guess not. I could have sworn we did. I don't know. I'm just confused now. I thought we already had the Banner of the Gods, but I guess we didn't. Um, hmm. Plus 15% chance to hit. Well, what does your sword do? Yours is actually good already. Plus one armor. If I could put him on a horse, I wouldn't be so hesitant. Oh, okay. So it only gives him eight hit points anyway. That That's fine in that case. There we go. Done deal. Uh, we'll regenerate everybody after we've done the duel, because the duel is, well, right there. And you don't have to... Right? You have to go to the crossroads first, that might help. Uh, the duel is right there, and it's not particularly long, it's it's a duel, so Thorgar will go in there, stomp some face, victory will be his. So let's go to the crossroads. 
and then we will take the fork. The city of Talabayim is to the south, around its walls a gathering horde awaits the arrival of the demon prince. Scattered remnants of the Talabalek Talabekland army have been sent to the east and might cause problems if allowed to remain behind in Thorgar's advance. Well, they're obviously not going to be able to do that. We're going to go across that bridge. Thank god we don't have to fight across the goddamn thing, because I have bad memories of the Empire campaign having to force a crossing across that bridge, though admittedly we did go around using a ford. There was a way across that didn't involve banging our heads straight into the face of the enemy. But it wasn't, it wasn't exactly easy anyway. The survivors of Thorgar's invasion have been gathered under the banner of Count Fuerbach of Talabekland, who even now is leading his ragtag army to the defense of Talabayim. So this is an Elector Count that we're going to fight. Cool. Do I want to give him a ring? The Ring of Enfeeblement. Actually, yes, I do want to give that to him. Ring of Enfeeblement, kind of a big deal. Everything else he's got, pretty good. Let's do it. Fight. Every elector count of the of the Empire wields a runefang, a deadly magical sword forged at the birth of the Empire by the dwarf runesmith Alaric the Mad. Those things are a big deal. They're a very big deal. If they get lost, Does such a creature things are still bad. possess the bravery of a man. Or will it skulk behind its armies and allow them to bleed for its glory? Are you brave Boy, enough to stop being a dick. Have this axe. Fight! Oh, so... Hey, what? 35? Now I'm confused. It said I had more hit points than that. It said I had 40. What ifs? It should be fine. We'll throw Will of the Gods down. We have health potions if we need to use them. I don't think we will, because Thorgar's pretty good. He's, he's going to smack this guy. He's going to hurt. Let's use the Curse of Chaos. And then hit him again. Even on a horse, though, this guy only has 40 hit points. So Thorgar's, Thorgar's pretty decent if he's got 35 and he's unmounted. Though he is, of course, a demon prince. So that, there is that. Can we use Decapitate yet? No. I would really like it if we could. Apparently we can't set ourselves on fire when we're in a duel. That's that's depressing. I was really hoping I could set myself on fire Human Torch style. Alright, use this. Slap him up a bit. What's he down to? 20? 19? That's not too bad. Once we get him down to about 12, I think we'll be able to use Decapitate. Actually, does Thorgar have any points to spend? I think he does. Is there anything in dueling that I would really like? No, not really. There's there's pretty much nothing that I would like anymore. I guess we'll go with that. It's pretty much the best of kind of mess choices. Not enough power, but we could do it, right? If that's so... I'm going to put in a minor magical infusion. There we go. Yes, decapitate. Finish him. Come on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Beautiful. Potion of sustenance. Major power stone and major um, major magical infusion. The tide of Glass. chaos stretches even further. English, I know, I'm meant to be able to speak it. I'm sorry. <laughs> but we won! Victory! Victory was ours. And now, we can continue on to our horde. But I think I will leave that for next video, because I'm not sure if there's a cutscene to go along with it. There might be. So, I'll leave it for next video. In which we will attack Talabayam. There's a couple of other things here outside the camp, the Horde of Thorgar, etc, etc. But there's only one major thing. Well, two. There's this, and then there's the actual battle. So next time with me, Grey Hunter, we attack Talabayam, and it will be glorious.